All right, let's go ahead and get started with our exam now. Before I hand out the exam, let's pray and uh, hand those out and we'll get started. Lord, I do thank you for these students. I pray that you'd help them to do well on this exam. Lord, I pray that you would calm their nerves and um, Lord, just help them to work carefully and accurately the things that they know. Uh, there's nothing on here that they don't know, nothing on here they haven't learned and aren't good with. So Lord, help them just to take the test with confidence, not to make careless mistakes though. I pray this would be their very best work. I pray it be a good reflection of how hard they've worked this semester. I pray it be an accurate reflection of their understanding of the algebra that I've taught them. Uh, Lord, I pray for Gavin and Brecken as they take it. Um, Lord, that you help them in a special way. And Lord, no, Abby's missed quite a bit of class time here toward the end. Lord, bless her in a special way also. Um, Lord, help the students to remain focused as uh, they're looking forward to Christmas vacation. Lord, help them to put those other thoughts out of their mind and focus on this test. Do a great job and then enjoy their vacation afterward. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. All right, when you get your exam, put your first and last name in the name spot and today's date in the date spot. Today is 12-21-21. 12 21, 21. Oh. oh, did I give you two? I might have yeah. given you two. I was like, what is this? And I handed you one. I, I keep doing this. I keep getting oh. Genesis 2 and Kendall 1. Really anyway. All right. Anyway, first and last name. And today's date. Yeah, it's, it's only six pages. So if you're like, 12 pages. No, it's, it's only six. All right. First last name, 12, 21, 21. Let's take a look at the exam together. First page, things we've said over and over again throughout the course of this semester. Write the word or phrase that best completes each statement. Obviously, some answers will require more than one word. If you get stuck on this, move on, come back to it, because you'll probably see a problem that uses one of those things later that might jog your memory. Uh, page two. Got some polynomial arithmetic on there, some, uh, you know, adding, subtracting, multiplying, dividing, raising to powers, all that fun stuff. Um, do notice 24 is a monomial, 25 is a binomial. Okay, so a little difference there. Uh, number 26 through 28, you're factoring, factor completely. Uh, page three, we got some radical expressions, reduce, rationally, simplify each of them, basically. Got some complex numbers there, 33 to 35, and then a couple rational expressions on 36 and 37 to simplify as well. Page four, all equations, various types of equations we've worked throughout the course of the school year, or the course of the semester, I guess I should say. And then page five, a bunch of inequalities, which is what we've worked a little more recently, um, solving all of those. Uh, notice on page five, be sure to write your answers in interval notation. Okay, write them in interval notation, which is what we've been doing of late anyway. And page six, we've got just a couple word problems on there as we finish out the exam. All right, you will have one hour and seven minutes for this exam. Unless you're watching on YouTube, then you have as much time as you want. <laughs> All right, you may get started. Be sure to use that blank paper as a cover sheet. <laughs> 